Ready for play. So, here we go. Settle down, please. First set. Match off to begin. Karen Hachanov to serve. Play. It's funny how sometimes I kind of hold my breath for the first point in a Kyrgios match because sometimes you can see right away that he doesn't really want to compete. He's come out in the first point and played a perfect point, even though it didn't end up winning it. No surprise. We'll see how this plays out tonight, but in the Four matches Kyrgios has won here, short points, much to his benefit. Fortino, we showed you that graphic for just a second the last time they played. It was a five-setter. Four of the sets were tie breaks. Both of these guys seem to be able to hold serve pretty well against each other. Okay. Tachano. That match, Jimmy's talking about, that was in Melbourne just before COVID, and that's when Curious, he has his own personal arena. <laughs> Every one of his matches is played. I believe it's the third court there. But he loves it. It's about seven, 8,000. They go crazy for him. And all of it's your sets and the good effort by Hachinov to push that match to four tiebreak sets. So if he continues playing like this, he makes finals of us you know, down under. Is he going to get them to play the final on a 7,000 seat? Curious. <laughs> they didn't really think he can get it done in Rod Laver Arena. Yeah. Six foot six inch players yeah. that Love covers a lot of ground. I mean, that was a good serve, decent drop shot, did get too much height. 15. One thing about Kyrgios, he seems to be a player that does think on the court, and he has gone four for four, serving to the Hachinov forehand, and he's gotten chip return. So he obviously knows Hachinov waits with more of a backhand grip and has trouble changing grips and ripping the forehand return, so he's serving there. Now he'll probably go T. Game. Curious. <laughs> because you don't want the player that you're playing against to know that that's where you're going every time. Well, both guys have uh, One game won game. four First matches to get here, and so clearly they've served well. Curious has only dropped his serve six times. Hatchinoff only nine. And that includes, of course, a five-setter that he played. Five setter against a very good team. returner exactly. in Karenia Busta. Right. So, again, the racing form would say not going to be a lot of breaks tonight. Well, I guess it would also say whoever gets broken mm -hmm. is in trouble. Yes, probably in that set.
very passive returning early on from Kyrgios because he could do more with that backhand return. We saw against Medvedev him taking the backhand return very early. So far, just standing pretty far behind the baseline for him. Not putting a whole lot on the returns. Oh. If Kira starts doing that to second serve, he, which he can't. That was a 100 mile an hour second serve. And he punished it. He has that ability. His return, especially his backhand return, is remarkable. Indicates right there the tempo. Is this is likely to be played at three games, six minutes. Let's for seven. Just a. The ATP rankings information though next Monday, the top three will be Nadal, Rude, and Alcaraz. The order will be determined this week, but they will be the top three. Thirty love. Rude. <laughs> That's some story. And if Djokovic had properly been given his 2,000 points for winning Wimbledon, he'd be two right now. Still, because he's sort of hardly played. Yeah, he'd be two. Yeah, the rankings are yeah, the rankings sort are, of so was convoluted the, right now. That was the, uh, it's there. Someone explained to me that, um, that the players didn't want rankings to be uh, affected anymore. Daily Show. Uh, as they had been because of COVID and of course, the initial reaction was, look at how screwed up they are now. Yes, they are. Okay. Screwed up. Here we are. Two games all. Don't like the energy coming out of Kyrgios just yet. There he is again, sort of flexing his left leg, his ankle. He's been shaking it a couple of times. Well, he, he hasn't told his, anyone in his box to stand up and cheer yet. The way that usopen.org is your online home for all the live scoring during this week. Get all the information, real time stats, and draws. It's all at usopen.org. Curios, as most would know, has played doubles. Seeing Kokonakis were knocked out last night, but they had a long three setter. Match tie break eventually decided. And they lost a second set tie break as well. So, yes, they did have a long match. He looked pretty good on that return forehand combination. Pitino. Feet moved beautifully to that return.
The Chief Team. Mr. Kyrgios is requesting a review on the right baseline. Back serve, backhand down the line. Winners 14, 15. for Hatchinoff. And right now, both players are just cruising through their service games. Ones no one has pushed yet. Now China leads by three games to two. And they played a tie break, Jimmy. <laughs> that was a gem. It was. Thank you. It was really the match almost hinged on that yes. tie break in so many ways. What was surprising a little to me was Medvedev. I felt tired oh. as that match wore on. I didn't think Medvedev gets tired, or if he does, he can play through it. 15 love. I don't know if it was nervous tension from him because he was defending champion. He knew number one ranking was was on the line. He also had lost three of four times already to Kyrgios. All those things. He was playing a whole new style, returning serve from close to the That's baseline enough. rather than where he normally stands. Forty left. It is the tennis definition of rapid fire, curious serving. Hatch enough not far behind him either, by the way. Game curious. Well, team curious missing Kokonakis three games old. Apparently moved First on. Their exit from doubles. I enjoyed sort of mentioning that after I saw them lose and double saying this was a big match for Kyrgios because he loses one of the guys that's supposed to stand up at the right time and sit down at the right time that have been helping him all tournament long. And Kokonakis didn't know if he would stick around, and I guess the answer is he wasn't going to. How many of those people did you have on under contract when you played Jimmy I had Harris? Zero, actually. <laughs> Standing head down after one of the longer rallies we've seen. 15 shots. Don't like this body language, posture, anything from Curios right now. Notable, Jimmy, because we just finished a match where Coco Goff didn't have the same part of it. Obviously, was her opponent, but didn't have that fire. Fire, exactly. And the crowd, yes. 23,000 people didn't get into the match. And they haven't gotten into this one right, yet either. Exactly. 40. In the crowd's defense, this so far has been mostly. I'm going to serve a couple bombs. You're going to serve a couple bombs. We're going to hold serve and walk to the other side. So it's hasn't been compelling just yet. Game a channel. No In this case, you're to the chairs. 
John Offerman. Well, this is different. Game Seven games three. in 18 minutes, nothing close to even a deuce point. It's amazing how Kyrus doesn't even have to serve big to hit aces because it's so well disguised and it hits his spot so well, so close to the lines. 40 love. Yeah, that one was big. It was 122, but almost every player serves 122 nowadays. And they don't just go whizzing past. Let's Something about his serve freezes people. It does seem as though he hits it pretty quickly right out of his hand. Oh. because there is a, it's a phenomenon. I'm not sure what, how you would explain it scientifically, but I, as I always say, pitching reminds me so much of serving. In pitching, there were certain people that had what they called easy power in their arm. It didn't look like they were throwing hard. Game, curious. And they threw 95. Yeah. And as a result, your timing is way up. Because you're not, you look you're at not the motion, you're not yes. anticipating it. Four games all, first set. He, his motion is so pure. It is. It's perfection. Yeah. Really. But the rhythm of it. It's set. Serve is all rhythm. Making sure everything's going up at the ball at the right time. You got to get all those pieces working together. He does it effortlessly. So we continue just cruising through service games. Now we're getting to the pressure time. So you get an idea why their last meeting two and a half years ago was four tiebreaks. You get the idea, but I still think Kyrus is missing. That's seven backhand on four stairs for him. He normally is so sturdy in that department with his backhand. Still feel like if Kyrgios was playing the way he's played in this run, he's Don't you love? just better enough than Hatchinoff that he could get through this. He would make a few more returns. They played in Australia. 13. Curious. 33 aces. Dropped to serve once in the five sets. Hachanov was broken three times. They did have a 6 2 set, which clearly was two of them. 14. How many aces did Hachanov have when? 21. Okay. Curious at 33. Both serve 67% for serves. I mean, that's just crazy. Okay, Hachanov. It's with the backhand. Another bad air. Hachanov leads. That he connects it to the knee. He keeps. It could Watch be. It. it could be. Yeah. You can see him shaking out the knee every once in a while. 
He's serving to stay in this first set, and he hasn't really doesn't really have to hit too many shots on his serve. It's, it's mostly just serve winners. He hits, a, he hits a 114 second serve there in a good spot, like it's nothing. Yes, like it's nothing. Love. Confirmation these two guys can serve. Let's for service. Forty love. Again, it's a hundred and twenty one. It's not that big to get past hatching off as often as it is, but it's just he's leaning a little maybe because of the first game where every serve went to the forehand. So he started getting aced down the tee to the backhand. Another chip forehand return, but that one with some pretty good depth. Game curious. But a drama Five free set. First set. I'm not sure if we had a 30 all point. No. I don't, that I, had I don't think so. Kyrgios has lost five points, and Hatchinoff has lost four. <laughs> it's her. Through five games. Left. Dirty love. Forty love. You better be careful because this is shades of when Wimbledon changed the grass surface yes. because it was <laughs> just serving aces, even Isovich Rafter, and the next year the grass was slow. It was it was two years before Federer Roger would became, win Wimbledon. Roger, Thank yes. you. But it was something of a changing of the guard. 15 you know, Sampras, seven time champ, never won another match at Wimbledon. So anyway, all of that means this this set has had that feel to it, as Jimmy yes. accurately said. That should not backing way up for the second serve. Yeah. That ended up being a great play for Hatching up. Maybe that's the know? answer. It it is actually what I was thinking Medvedev should have done against Kyrgios is stand up a little closer for the first serve but on second serve maybe back up to where you're more comfortable to start the point. Ooh, it's there so now the first 15 country this is the first even 15 30 we've had. Forced errors to two. Part of the reason Hatchinoff doesn't have any unforced errors, he doesn't have time. It's either he's getting aced <laughs> or Kyrgios within a shot or two is hitting a winner or missing. Oh, good there's, 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 there's the winner. Yep. Finally, yep. with the backhand that he yep. normally hits so well, that's his first point. Goes behind Hatchinoff.
right, first deuce point. Deuce. Hachanov. I think I'd rather see a Kyrgios sort of getting angry something yeah. yelling at his exactly. box than this. Exactly. That was the first double as you saw and now a second serve coming on set point. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, the worked well for Kyrgios serve and volley but Hachanov gets him there and Last second steals Life the first game set. Five. Fifteen love. Haven't been a whole lot of long points yet. Not much. Not much that demands heavy movement. Well, I just so got a uh, you love. Little note from U.S. Open Hawkeye. Kyrgios's backhand is down three miles an hour tonight. He was missing 9% of his backhands that he hit during the tournament. He's missing 30% so far. else has to to have Dirty him have a team. chance the crowd has to juice Let's him up a case. little bit right now Okay, a channel. First game, second set. Well, the vibe continues to be a downer from Curious. Yeah, another backhand error, sort of throwing his hands up to his box. I think there's. I get a watch out, please. Thank you. You're worried about him finishing almost the way he's absolutely. Acting. I think if the crowd wants more, I think That's they can get involved and maybe he'll, his cap will hurt a little less. But it's hard for the crowd to get involved if you don't give them anything. And at the moment, Kyrgios isn't really helping. He's not giving the crowd much to cheer about. Pity love. Two nights ago, Kyrgios talked about the fact he did not want to match on Ash. He mentioned he's never had success here. He won two matches in a row this week, beats Medvedev, and he says, I feel like I've been able to showcase my ability. There's a lot of celebrities here. I don't want to fucking fight for this shit. 
I really don't want to play for it. Work your way through it, Mike. Let's work your way through it. You got this, Nick. Come on, keep that energy up. There's the battle right there. You could hear it. Yeah, he wants to pull the ripcord right now. He's looking for someone to just tell him, you know what, you're... You're injured. 14. Day. And this is the... This is the curious collision because he, he said two nights ago, I wanted to get on Ash and show them I'm able to put my head down, play, and win big matches. And curious. He said for the tennis world, I think it's important as well. People were starting to doubt my ability. One and game now, more, second set. While is that watching? I had no idea that service was provided here. Me neither. I've been here two and a half weeks. I'm sort of due. Bring them up. <laughs> but back to the curious thing. I mean, that's this is the collision. So here's curious saying, I don't want to play through this, and his team is saying, Yeah, you do. Yeah. Yeah, you do want to play through it. Missing shots. Maybe it's hurting a little bit, but if you just watch his footwork during the point, he Thank can you. move. Settle down, please. Just needs one of those type of shots to go. Dino. One of the spectacular shots that brings the house down, and then maybe he'll want to start playing. Well, he hit what three of them in the tiebreak, the first set tiebreak here two nights ago against Medvedev. If he had three shots that were just sparkling. He hit a drop shot that exactly. was incredible at 11 exactly. all in the tiebreak after a couple other amazing shots. Fifteen catching. For Hatchinov, he's got to do his best to not even look at Kyrgios. Just put your head down. Keep him feeling like I don't want to play. You can't give him a little bit of a opening, which this game could be because I don't remember Hatchinov ever being at thirty all. So this is the first time he's had to anything that you could construe as an important point on his serve. shot to get the crowd involved. I mean, that was an amazing chip. Look at how he dug in and was moving beautifully forward. So good get, good touch. And then if you Thank can you. see Curious, which you couldn't, he was he was covering ground to cover that drop volley if there was one. Dirty love. Would, would you uh, suggest going Alcaraz, going to the back wall, like we saw last night? 
No, because I think Kyrgios just serves too accurately. He'll get you out wide. I think the J.J. Wolf's coach asked me before he played Kyrgios in the third round, what do you think with return? Can, can you read it? How do you read it? And I said, I, I've watched Kyrgios play a million matches. I don't think you can read his serve. It's the only thing I can tell you is he almost never goes body. So if I was playing Kyrios, I think I would just start guessing at some point and hope I guessed right four times in a game. Forehand, a loose volley. Yeah. Again, the feet are flat. But it's clear that's what Kyrgios is going to do to adjust. And Pachinov's going to be back. Kyrgios said, I'm coming in. Which he should. Yeah, that was a simple volley for him, really. Pachinov drops that one right in. Juice. One of the things that in Washington on his way to that title, but one of the things that drove him crazy Please. was when he had a 40 love lead on a service game and someone got back to Deuce. He would start yelling at his box. Great disguise, and then just too much height, girt, weight going forward for Hatchinoff to turn around on the lob. Didn't read it at all. U.S. Open shop is the official shop Curiosity for U.S. Open merchandise gear for the family and a one-of-a-kind U.S. Open accessories. You can visit usopenshop.org. You can tell Kyrgios is a VIP in Washington. The owner of the tournament is sitting in his box. Today. He's won it twice. Yeah. Uh, he was also owns now World Team Tennis. Love the team. Just a terrific supporter of, in the literal sense of tennis in America. Fifteen all. Now you would think if you're hatching off and you see someone that's that was a half step slow at least Kyrgios run into the backhand you probably think about serving wide and then hitting them to the open court make them move as much as you can. Forty-three. The aces for both catching off with eleven now. Again, a channel. Not an easy hold, but it is 
Four now. Curious. Break in hand in the second set after Hatchinoff broke to win the first. Now we've had a few rallies in this. The break of serve. Curious was well earned. He's just got to sort of keep the feet going as he can. Love to do. Fifteen all. Thirty. Fifteen. That's the serve you were referencing a while back, Jimmy. Where that one must feel like it gets on you so quickly. Yes, that was at least, it was 128 yeah. miles an hour, so that was pretty big, but guys don't react. Yeah, the way his motion is there, those those would feel like 150, I yeah. think, if you're the receiver. Team. Yeah, I did have the misfortune of returning Pete Sampras' serve, and I had a similar feeling. Game, here we Returning his serve, I couldn't read it. Well, that's a curious special right there, 4-2. Kyrgios leads by four games to two, second set. Ted Robinson with Jimmy Arias, and I have just learned something about Jimmy, my friend, and I'm so impressed. You returned Pete Sir. You got it back. Well, occasionally. <laughs> Thing is, we used to practice. We used to practice quite a bit, so I practiced with him. Okay, did not know and, that. And I don't like to practice without having something on the line. So, thirty love. Even if it's fifty cents, I want to play. I want to feel a little. I don't want to hand you anything when it's over. I want that feeling in practice. So, and we would play, and I. You, I he needed a point, he'd hit an ace. I just, I could not seem to read his serve. And watching Kyrgios serve, you get that same feeling. You just, yeah. the ball goes up, he would have almost his back turned to you, and then all of a sudden, a little wrist snap, and you just watch the ball go past. particular reason he then stepped in and hit a beautiful backhand but he set yes. up the backhand with that shot yeah. and you heard the response yeah So it is still a set to Hachanov and a break to Kyrgios in the second, second set. First set, Hachanov. Love. 
See the problem for Kira is he's so focused on his leg that his footwork has gotten not where it needs to be to be consistent. You have to have your feet underneath you. He's played more matches without using his feet than any player, so he's better than most people while he's in this situation. But I've seen a few points where he has let the feet mm -hmm. become active and Wide and barrel in. But a great second serve as well. Yeah, right. So it just feels out. He can get there. He just has to tell himself, I'm okay, let me run, let me let me give everything I have oh. for this match. There's a match I called and I wish I could remember who you might be able to oh. find out for me. Roger Federer lost in the finals of Canada one of the years in his back. Don't you all. I think it was finals, might have been mid semis. His back was obviously just by the way he was moving. He couldn't really play to the best of his ability, but he tried so hard to show nothing, to show you the crowd wouldn't have known. It was obvious. It was obvious to me because there just you could see a few times when yeah. he wouldn't make a quick move to the ball. He kind of just end up letting it go past him. Never said a word, finished the match. I'd love Kyrgios to sort of try to adopt that attitude. He, instead, he's been showing you for the last hour how his leg hurts. He wants everyone to know. Federer, in fact, 2017, lost the final in, in Montreal to Sverre. Tweaked his back and then pulled out of Cincinnati. Yes. Yes. But he finished that match. Yes, he's been right. never retired. Yes. And you could see that he was yeah. half of himself normally. I mean, his last match, the last match Rogers played, he, uh, many others would have stopped. Wimbledon against Hercotch, he hurt his knee in the in a second set tie break, lost the tie break, and he, but he played the third set on one leg, base, I mean, relatively speaking. But Roger, very proud of the fact he's never once retired. Love the team. Anything else I can research for you? <laughs> well, I'll think of something if this goes five. Fifteen <laughs> all. Thirteen. Again, touch back at it. So Hachinov holds easily, and a big part of uh, Curious leads by the rest of this four. night is going to be determined in the next few minutes. Even the match. Thank you. Ah. 
Now frustrated yeah. trying to stay in the point. I, I do know the zero to fours, they had 84 of those points coming into this game out of. 84 out of 111, yes. so that's in mid 70s percent. They were eight from Don't you love. above yeah. nine. Hatchinoff won five, and Kiros has won three of those eight that over nine shots. Yeah. There's your average rally. So that's that's the Kyrgios norm. That's where he succeeded. Short points. Twenty seven of the points in this first set have been eight or two sets have been aces. Set 30 15, great return down low, and then just the casual Thank you. perfection of that half volley drop shot. Ooh. Not again. Not there. Forty thirty. There wasn't a lot of explosion in the movement there by Curios. Not hard to imagine this is set being must win for Curious. Let's for service. He guessed right again. Curious. Needed to hit that with a forehand grip. He guessed right so early. He had plenty of time. Instead, it's a third set point after 132 mile an hour serve set up the forehand. Give us something, Nick. Set a piece. Everybody's happy but Nick. Thank you. Ready for play. Third set. A chance off to serve. There you go. Thank you, James. Third set. Thank you. Michael Fuhrer has run the. Stadium experience, the in-house systems here Jeez. for a long, long time for the USTA. He's very smart. You heard what he just did? Queued up Sweet Caroline during this set changeover to get the stadium going. He can only get them going oh. for yeah. so long. Yep. And then the players have to do their part. And normally they do. Body serve. Fifteen love. Fifteen all. The 
Richie, Richie. His feet were a little bit more alive on Come that on. return, and he got back. He pushed off quickly to get back into the middle of the court. And maybe that caught Hatchinoff's eye a little bit, caused, helped cause that miss. Suddenly, 15-30, Hatchinoff's had almost no pressure on his serve at any point other than no the game he was broken. We've had two break points in two sets. Each one converted. Game and actually has moved slightly better. He also has not asked for any repeat treatment in the one three minute timeout. Juice. Was a nice calm yeah. erasing of the break point yeah. from Hatchinoff. You see the small Hatchinoff team. He is a married guy, also a dad. So he's in position. He does not normally miss too many backhands. He's missed a Thank whole you. host of them today. That one found just a little piece of the line. Another break chance. Oh, both break points. Hit that little wide one. That wide one short and hard. Yeah. That combination in the ad court's tough to defend against. If you hit the spot, it's not that easy to hit that spot. He's done it twice. He's gone at the body on the second serve the last couple times. Medvedev is home watching this thing. Why didn't you have these issues against me? I mean. Come on. Don't give him that good juice, mate. Come on. Stay with you. Come, Come on. on. First game of this sort in the match. Just lengthy game. Two break chances for Curious. Advantage our channel. Now this was Again, when you're playing someone you think might be injured, this is usually the play. Serve out wide, smack one to the other side. Make them have a nice long sprint. Game. Yeah. Yeah. Puts an end to that long game with an ace. 
it's 15 now. First game, third set. Brief run did Hatchinov in the top 10 a few years ago. To his team, they're not to the chair. Yeah, but I almost felt as though he might be talking to the chair That's the way he was first. sort of yeah. turned his way. I think he was complaining it's fundamental that he should have broken serve. He had two yeah. break chances. Take your seats quickly, please. Thank you. Well, complicated guy, understatement, curious, and right <laughs> now he's exhibiting the. It's the his demeanor on court is really violates a commandment of entertainment. Right? Act like this is the only thing in the world you want to be doing. Yeah. Because everybody here would like to be you right now. <laughs> yeah. Everybody yeah, here wishes this. they were good enough to do this. Yeah. Dirty love. Things. It's not about his tennis. He's playing. His play's been fine. It's the. It's just his demeanor is the word I keep coming back to. Game his curious. play's been fine, and he's playing. A guy, as you mentioned, had crept into the top ten at one time, has dropped one out a little ball. bit now, and he's playing about seventy percent of what he's capable. Okay, right. And they're at a set all and even in the third, and he's the guy who had a couple of break chances in the last game. So just that's the part that's frustrating because you know how good he can be. I like that he hit himself in the leg after missing that return because it's starting to look the feet are moving just a little bit more than they were the first two sets, and he's frustrated that he missed that return. So so you're saying he cares a little. Still complaining about the break points. That's what he just yelled. But you got to give maybe a little bit left. of credit to Hatchinoff. He did hit two bomb exactly. serves, exactly short and wide in the box in the ad court. I mean, he deserves a little bit of credit for saving those break points. Game for Curious, but New balls, we have a set of piece on serve after three games of the third. Two games to one. One Four more quarters on this stadium court tomorrow. Thank you. 
Spatila. Looking for the back now, mate. Looking good. Looking really good. Give that team credit, man. That's been relentlessly positive for an hour and a half. It has. They are, were almost talking him out of. Yeah. He had a moment where he looked like he was going to pull a ripcord. Pitino. Ah. Sixth unforced error for Kyrgios, 13 in the match for Hatchinov only. There, fastest tonight for Curious, 132. Okay, Curious. So we move on. We've had two games all. That's a good night. Late night fans. So we've had 26 games. In this match, three of the 26 have had break point chances. Those are your ways Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, all following the U.S. Open. And hashtag U.S. Open. Oh. So all but three of the games have been pretty straightforward. It's been a steady diet of when Kyrgios yeah. tries to attack Hatchinov's second serve. Hatchinov goes pretty big at the body. And it has caused some problems for Kyrgios, partly because he's been so flat-footed. Oh. Okay, that that's a good point, Jimmy, because Hatchinov has not needed the first serve. He's winning 69% on his second serve. 60. Okay, just up that there. Something that Kyrgios just did is he ran around his backhand, and I just got another note on how in this match so far, both of these players have hit far more backhands than forehands. 54% of the shots have been backhands for Kyrgios, 59% for Hatchinoff, meaning most times you see players running around anything down the center. That hasn't been the case here. 14. Okay. Hachanov. The trend continues. Easy hold for Hachanov. Hachanov leads by three games to two. Midway That's point of the third one set. Is it the midway point of the match?
about the team. So Hatchinov winning a high percentage of his seconds. Curios only 45. Good news for Curios as he makes so many first serves. Yep. 15 and of course, the Curios second serve is uh, trends toward first serve territory. Yeah, it is. <laughs> The team. Team. All even on 14 team. aces in the match, but I feel as though there's more unreturned serves. Game Kyrgios. Easy hold for three all. Feels as though Kiras makes it so in the terms of hatching off hats. So Kiras double faults to start the game and then just serves four straight <laughs> beauties and it's no big deal. No big deal. I was worried a little bit when he because he did. He is trying harder. And he got a good play. He did. Love the team. But the footwork for Kyrgios has improved. Take a look at this. If you see it, he gets out there. He dug the foot in to get back. Recognized the ball was coming back behind him. Got a little fortunate, obviously. Top of the tape, so. Love 15. And in this match, that's kind of pressure. Don't think of Hatchinoff as a guy that comes in much. He just Dump. did a beautiful little half volley drop shot there at somewhat of an important moment. Whack the forehand, hesitated for a minute, ended up having to come up with that ball and dropped it over perfectly. From Kyrgios, I know Hatchinoff won the point. It's a great point from Hatchinoff. But Kyrgios ran and dug and tried. Forty. Pretty good response from Hatchinoff because he's play, he's played a guy that's been flat-footed and energy level down, and all of a sudden, Kyrgios, this game came to break. Okay, Hatchinoff. And Hatchinoff played a great yes, game. Yes, he did. Well, no surprise Hachanov given their past. Hatchinoff beats games to three. Third set, one to two. Kyrgios continues. He's 12 for 12 in this set, getting first serve in. And most of the time, he doesn't have to hit anything but the serve. Fortilov. And there's a racket shake to his box. That's the first sign of anything positive we've seen. Game curious. And that game right 
there. That's the first time I thought we've seen the real curious today. He says the energy zone. will hop in the Actually, last game as well. Last he did the last game. He he moved. He tried to play, and Hatchnop just played a pretty good game. Curious did it in 47 seconds. He did, but he still managed. Thank you. To get his player box to jump up four times in that 47 <laughs> seconds. Certainly. If you're in his box, you got to do aerobics. By the way, I saw Mark I in the tournament director in Washington. He was up four times as well. Good team, <laughs> yes. Taking the second serve really early on the kick serve and control that backhand down the line. It's what he did so. One of the things he did so well against Medvedev. That's the first time he's done it. He's Sutton has switched on with Kyrgios. Is he wants to win again? He'll suddenly throw in a completely different shot. 15, 15. And in that rally, all of a sudden, he just hit a slice for him. No one does that. And it sort of helps Hatchinoff make the error. Right. So how long before we get an underhand serve? Uh, I mean, let's see how long <laughs> the Kyrgios wants to win. Yeah. Kyrgios is here. He's, this is his third straight game. So first in his feet, and then he started Something. to show it. Something kicked in. Thank you. Settle down, please. Players are ready. Thank you. Please. Thirty fourteen. Off is safe. Three break points in the set with three outstanding serves. He has, and he could switch Kyrgios off again if he yes. manages to hit another big serve here. And so this is a massive point in this match. Thank you. A warning. Kyrgios did such a good job sort of hanging in there, and now that was the shot he could turn the point around, but the forehand got away from him. And so did the racket. Yeah. Well, apparently, no warning. Matching off the save four now in this set.
game. Ah, Chanov. Well, an hour and 50 minutes. Ah, Chanov leads by five games to four. Third set. One set. This third set plays out. He didn't entertain much the first hour and a half, but he's getting there now. Love the team. Uh oh. Real danger moment now for Kyrgios. He put a Love lot into trying to get that break. He had a couple of break chances. And this is where he can go. To have that serve because hatching off if I'm at this point, I'm thinking I'm a goalie. Right, no rush. Just Come put it off. in the right. court. Somehow Thank get your you racket on it and put it in and hope Curio self destructs. Oh. oh, right at the feet. And from two break points moments ago, 15, 15. it spun to two set points. Hatchinov. Thank you. Please. Somehow, Kyrgios gets out of this. Look at that grip. And it helped cause the shank off a ball that he got to comfortably. Poor drop shot. Still a set point. He couldn't give a good serve with that kind of reprieve. But almost always come up with a great serve. Juice. Thank you. Two bombs in a row. Now, game point. And that bombs is curious. Shake to his box. As that missed drop shot might be shot that causes Hatchin off this match. Yeah. Yes. And an escape for now for Curious. Had a moment. Five games all. Third set. Remember these stakes. And Kyrgios just played for the Wimbledon Championship. Aaron Hatchinov has never been in a major semifinal. It's a nice response from Hatchinov because it's amazing when you're in a Kyrgios match, one or moment, one point can make a whole difference, can make or break the whole match. And Hatchinov, I think, had he come up with that forehand off the drop shot, Kyrgios might have been too much for him. That might have been it. As it is, Hatchinov's going to play awfully, have to play well to win this set. Think. Because he's not dealing with the real curious. Well, Kajanov put the brakes on. He got the ball behind. 15 all. But 15 all. In the last couple of games, Kiros is backhand. Five miles an hour Ready bigger for than it had been the rest of the match. When he's rallying, he's he's engaged. Well, now 
Oh, we're all getting it. They're both into it. Ball striking. Superb. Yeah, it's well, awesome. She, she, this is how this match could have been played from the start. It's nice we got a little taste of it. Hundred and eighty two points so far. Only fifteen of them we saw have been nine shots or more. But there's fewer and fewer of those just one shots or no shots, just serve and not making a return. Hatchinoffs have to win these points. Hachano. Right, Hachano holds on. So, very ready to Hachano swing. Hachano wins by six games to five. That's it. One Finish central. to this uh, third set's coming up. Senses Kyrgios, that's how he won the first set with that exact Love shot. Team. Senses Kyrgios will close. Look, comes running in quickly. Once he does that, he's very susceptible to the law. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Love that you turn off the switch. Nope. Kyrgios dropped the first set, serving at 5 6. He almost. The four or five game here. Had to save two set points. <laughs> ridiculous. 116 mile an hour serve. Flattish. Down the tee and then run around and rip the forehand. Too good. Could use a first serve to help him out. He hasn't made any in this game yet. That should not make in the returns. 15 40. Exactly what happened in the 4 5 game. 15 40. Sets to one. New ball. Take a break. Two sets to one up. Thank you. Good. 
15 love. Yeah, that was a great return, and Hatchinov handled it pretty well. He's handled sort of the ups and downs from Kyrgios without showing anything, without letting anything bother him. Touchy love. Forty love. No, he hit a great first return in that game, but then missed a backhand, and that sent him in a negative swirl. He hasn't even stopped at his chair, Kyrgios, to towel off, get a quick sip, just walk straight over. This is a very important game for Kyrgios fans. Nine of the last ten points going Hatchinoff's way. Dino. Fortieth unforced air for Kyrgios. Thirty. Curious playing some high risk tennis at the moment. He hit a 118 mile an hour second serve, yeah. first point. 40. Couple of flat, hard ground strokes. He doesn't know the score. He thought he'd held serve, but it's 40 15. Curious playing high risk tennis. That, that knocked me off my chair for a second. <laughs> well, extra high risk. <laughs> That I've always been intrigued by. Someone that doesn't One game hasn't all. played Success. regularly much of his time as a pro. Hasn't admittedly devoted himself much to fitness. His career record in five set matches. Get right here. It's 11 good. and 3. Really stuff is good, Keith. Come on. Come on, kids. Well, he's never played five setter here. But it's 11 and 3. I mean, part of that could be. That if he's going to go ahead and go five sets, he's probably trying 
<laughs> and he's very good. Yeah. So I guess I, I bring that up because the, the, the fit there, inside. Well, right. there, there, there's a reflex, I think, reaction to say, OK, drop this third set. Kyrgios can't go five. He'll check out. Well, record would indicate not. He's twice come back from two sets down to win. That's also seemingly impossible. But again, he's that good. Mm -hmm. He can if he just competes. Hey! Oh. That's the biggest thing that he's missing is the ability to consistently compete. Thirty love. Not so this guy. We were referencing Ethan Isevich. There's Sachinov's wife Veronica. And the coach to the far right, not in the picture there. Is, uh, was Goran's old coach. Oh. off like a lot of players from his homeland, not referred to in this U.S. Open, went to, left to go get support. He went to split Croatia. Yes. Goran's hometown and connected with that coach who's there, Vedran Martic. This set, Hatchinoff can't buy a first serve, but he hasn't lost a point on second serve either. That's, that's the number that just charges in the match. He's winning. Hatchinoff is winning 72% of his seconds. Like two sets to one. 15 love. He broke once and it won him the second. Love. Pretty good approach. Nice flare on the finish. Forty love. Quickly throw in a nice ace. Get one of his quick service games out of the way, Kyrgios, seemingly. Game Kyrgios. <laughs> Let's see, was that one faster than 47 seconds? Got him. We had one that quick earlier. Two games in all. Full set. Ah, slowed him up a little bit. Thank you. Plays are ready. wins a game in the time it takes Rafa to win a point. <laughs> it's just it's crazy. All right, so because you are the Jimmy Arias, explain how in the heck is Hatchinov winning this on second serve? I'm just curious. Should he change something? Yes, he should change something because yeah. there's no, if you're 73% winning second serve points. The strange thing is a Garcia come in, line up in, play in the court. He's, he's tried that, that hasn't worked that okay. well. Maybe he should back up or yeah. start a point. Or do Alcaraz. Yes. Yeah. Let's the bottom line is he's losing more of the rallies. As if you look at the stats from that five to nine shot rallies. Hatchinoff has a fairly good edge in that number. So he's winning the points as they go on. Here's a chance, however, with 15, 30. a couple of errors from Hatchinoff. 
He hasn't made many of those. He's at 19 for the match only. Hatching off. Please. It's the Rockets fault. I think he probably has a few more in his bag if he wants to switch it out. Well, let's see. What serve, if you're curious, what serve do you protect? I mean, Please, I, thank I, you. he's gone hard and wide on the break points, but he's he's mixed it pretty well. Probably wide. Well, you tell this crowd that Here we are, it's it's like the 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 fifth set. You would like the odds of him riding this break of serve to push this match to a fifth. Defense. He's got great instincts. He's great anticipation. Do you think Kyrgios? Do you know? Normally, when he's got a lead with the serve, he goes ahead and takes care of business. Serves for sets, serves for matches. He usually serves a pretty good game. Two first serves to start this game, and both have come back from Hatchinoff. He's been making returns now for a while, more often than he did the first couple oh. sets. against most players has not worked against catching off all that well. Here's another example of it. He's getting that return down low and Kira's popping up the volley for the most part. Oh. Charging in behind that wide second. 15 14. Hachinov, Jimmy, you hit it. Hachinov's returning. He's returning well. I mean, that's that serve out wide. Yeah. You almost have to hit a winner return. Hit it so sharply. It's break points oh. to get right back in this fourth set. And another second serve. Oh. Game. And Kyrgios doubles. He went with 122 Three games second goal. serve. He didn't want to have a rally. Six. After the first point in that game where he defended well, yes. out rallied. Ladies Hatchinoff and gentlemen, him shocked with please what be fair to both players. Two. No applause during the rally or service motion. Thank you. Two points of net that gave the Curious lost. Over three years ago, Hachinov reached number eight in the world. It's 
won four titles, all of them on hard court. 15 all. He's now made the quarters in three of the majors, but never passed. Thirty. Biggest title one put him on the map was winning Bear C. Paris Bear C. The fall indoor. I believe he beat Djokovic on the way to that title. Forty two. For Kyrgios was taken away. And now leads by four games on to three. serve again in the fourth. And by two sets to one. So the uh, man is really defined by a serve. And some people I've heard during this summer streak, some people say this is one of the best serves ever in the sport. Kyrgios. 15 love. He's dropped to serve three times in the previous game, a critical one. Actually, all three have been critical. They have been the most important games, really. You know? Serving at 5 6 twice, and then not consolidating the break in the fourth. When you're down two sets to one. And that forehand that he just hit 30 feet long is not a good sign. Danger moments here, obviously. This, again, we've had a few of these anxious moments. For the most part, Kyrgios hasn't come through. Hachinov's done a really good job making returns. He's forcing Kyrgios to play a lot of points. He's not accustomed to hitting that 128 mile an hour serve and it keeps coming back. Game to us. 25th ace. And we're at four all. Four games all. Four sets. Still life in the curious game. Oh. 
Thank you. Fifteen love. Two and a half years since they last played it. Even with Kyrgios playing so well this summer, not much separates these two. No. I think part of it is hatching off as one of those new breed of tennis players. 50 moves so well you saw him defending here this was a great drop shot and it was two or three big strides and he covers the whole court Slicing to the backhand, Hatchinoff doesn't seem to like it that much. We'll see if he employs that a few more times. Players are ready. Thank you. Serve there, you charged it. And that one was actually right into the strike zone. Yeah, exactly. That was a bad miss from Kyrgios. That one didn't get the body. That's what's happening. Yes. I think Hatchinoff's box actually stood. No, I'm kidding. They didn't, <laughs> they didn't cheer, but almost everyone else did. Please. Uh oh. Juice. Once again, ladies and gentlemen. Respect both the players. Thank you. That one's a little frustrating for Kyrgios because he did guess right on the return and just tried to chip it back in play. Advantage, Machano. It's every point now. It's every point. I feel like catching off returns Ready for play. really good. He's just making yeah. returns. Yep. Not trying to do that much with him. Oh. And curious again as someone that is accustomed to those free points. Kachanov yeah. stayed far back on that love. second. Came in at 115. Love. 
40 now. Oh. <laughs> he might have to just get rid of that slide. Yeah. It hasn't worked. worked. Not sort of returning from an interesting spot in the court. He's back, but he's not as far back as. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here he is. Oh, as, could be. yeah as you see some players, he's sort of in the middle ground. You don't see too many players yeah. there, but part of the reason he can do that is he's Five six zone. six. So Four that six. ball would, if I was standing in that spot, I wouldn't be reaching shots. Probably the ball would be so high. It's not that bad for him to just gives him that little extra time that's allowed him to make returns. Thank you. Curious avoids uh, for the moment. 15 in the first and third sets. Matchinoff hits ace 23. And 24. Well, if Hatchinov holds serve here, it'd be difficult, wouldn't it, to not have in the back of your mind that twice you've been at 5-6 and you've been broken both times. Ah. 40 love. Ready for play. It's going to work. Hatchinov's done a, such a good job. He sort of changed his court position on return to serve. So after the first set, he backed way up on second serve returns. And in this fourth set, he's actually come forward. Hatchinov's come forward a foot and a half on the first serve return and has done a good job from up there of cutting off the angle just blocking returns in play and that's what's made the difference that's why he's made so many returns having said all that Kyrgios might find a way to hold serve this time at 5 6 he's 30 love up has come in often behind the second serve, so he didn't there. He's struggling to figure out how to win second yes, serve points, is. which even if he gets to a tie break, usually that stat sort of, the person winning that stat has a bit of an edge. And it's a one-way traffic in that stat. Second serve. That's five doubles in the match, but overall winning just 41%. The 
compared to Hatchinoff, 72. Voices down, please. Thank you. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Your hatching off feeling with so many others have felt in this day. He knows everybody's. They're not rooting against him. They just want the other guy. Well, I mean, he tried to at one point. He had a good shot and tried to get yeah. the crowd, and then actually realized, wait, no one's going to respond. Slices kept the ball down low. Hatchinoff lost patience. The long, easily the longest rally of the match. Thank three you. zero. Curious. Three one. Curious. his mind to Four, one. Curious. He does everything so well. And he's doing everything really well in this tie break. One sort of pulling the trigger too soon. Hatching off on a forehand that he missed. That's the only mistake Hatching off's made. And he's double breakdown oh. in the tie break. Please. Thank <laughs> you. 
Played Five four one. tie breaks Here the is. last time they met in Australia. They split them two each, but the last one was a match tie. Curios won. Could that be our destiny tonight? I mean. It wouldn't be shocking, especially with Kyrgios seemingly in control of this fourth set tiebreak. Full of set points. Six two. Curious. Still got three set points, two of them on my own serve. I'm gonna hit one into the first row, get rid of this point. Charapar doing a very good job of being very judicious in when he starts the serve clock to give the players a chance after that long Thank point. Thank you. That's what they came for. That's what they wanted. Well, Nick Kyrgios, this is the fourth Grand Slam quarterfinal of his career. He won his first quarter. This Ready for play. Wimbledon. Final set. And now he goes to the fifth set for the Kyrgios first time set. ever at the U.S. Open. But he has a sterling 11 and 3 career five set record. They're needed. Yeah, what defense from yes. Ashinov right out of the gate, first point. Oh. Almost seemed like Curious first overhead said, let me see you run a little more. Oh. Ashinov just won a five set match against Karenio Busta. His career record seven and eight. In five setters. Oh.
was excellent stuff from Hatchinoff again because that catching. one forehand that Kyrgios hit that he kind of shanked and it curled in was so tough to deal with. Curious, get that ball in. Well, it was a little help from the, <laughs> the frame because yes, that one had yes. a strange spin as we hit the three hour mark. Hatchinoff continuing to force Kyrgios to play points on his serve. Yeah. Well, he has passed well to me. He's lobbed no, well, he's passed well, he's returned pretty well. And he's got a break chance right out of the gate to start the fifth set. in that game, game. curious final set hatching off breaks Kiros didn't even play a bad game in any way he, he made for, he made first serves right but nothing free for him. no they were good returns and forced long rallies with hatching off tonight because he's got the crowd against him he's got curios with the phantom calf problem that suddenly went away he's got him yelling at his box from across the court while he's getting ready to serve he just sort of puts his head down and plays that's really well that's why you're areas you're so smart you know. that's a great point because what happened at Wimbledon this year, when Tsitsipas completely melted down, right, he couldn't handle Curious. Yes, and there is some murmurings in the locker room that Curious does the whole yelling in his box as a as a little bit of a momentum swinging ploy. Well, there's that body serve again, but this time he didn't quite get the left hip. He got more of the right hip, and Kyrgios ran around, and it was perfect for his forehand. Don't you all. Could be any murmurings in the locker room about Nadal taking an eight and a half minute timeout after losing the first set yesterday? <laughs> I mean, to adjust should. straps. There it's should not, be. It was not a medical timeout. Hmm. You're right. There should be. <laughs> Different standards.
split a couple of first Jeez. two sets that were flat. No real rallies, just all we saw were serves. All of a sudden, all we're seeing are rallies. What a 20 shot rally. more of those double faults because that second serve to the body is lower over the net. You're slicing it. You'd think you'd have a few. He's only had three in the match. Thank you. Deuce. Great answer. Well, that was pretty clutch. There you go. On the hip. And you got it. I try to so if you're curious, if he could just maybe one more step back, give him just a little more time to slide around that. Game. I try to. So double fault in the game, but a couple of aces. I try to backs up the break. Confused on what Curious is complaining about. What's he talking about with the fifth set? It's six minutes ago. Now he's at ten minutes. Oh, yeah. Jim. We're trying to figure out Curious. Well, does he I not? Make, I just want to make sure. No, is it, he doesn't know that the fifth set started. I mean, I'm sort of confused on what he's even talking about, but normally I at least have some idea. I don't want to waste too much energy worrying about it, but I sense he was directing it at that. Okay. His team. Okay. Yeah. See, like, come on, guys, get loud. Four teams. teams. I mean, like I said, you have to be in excellent shape to be in his player box because you got to get up and down. Yeah. Quickly yes. and often. He's going to have to come from behind after dropping serve in the opening game of this deciding set. Probably was the biggest catalyst to what we've eventually seen. Roof here. Ready to play. Redone with a roof armstrong. Hitting love. Twenty eighth ace for Hatching off. Dirty love. <laughs> a 
that had the the atom ball. Yeah, that had the double advantage of almost ending the match by taking <laughs> off Hachinov's <laughs> head and yeah. still going in. Yes. Shot that somehow goes in, a miss hit return, Don't and all of a sudden a little bit of pressure now on the Hatchinoff serve at 30 all. He's reacted poorly to this miss. He went through a whole litany of back and forth with his box after that shot. He saved a break point in his first Again. service game in this fifth set. He's down another one. Please. Pinpoint accuracy with his backhand when he when he needs to perfect pass down the line. Dialogue that never ends till the point starts. <laughs> Relentless abuse to his box, then they take it. Advantage, Achano. From Hatchoff, because remember that was the game with the Atom Ball. Leads by three games to one. That might have taken Final a few set. points out of him. Curious is that chances now in both Hatchoff service games to break. The level has gotten to another level, hasn't yes, it? Yes, the it first is. couple sets wasn't great. This is ridiculous how well they're playing now. <laughs> it was like the biggest, longest warm up you did ever expect in a major quarter. It like was. A, about an hour and a half of kind of, you know, they're out there, but. They were just serving. There was no other, right. nothing else happening. <laughs> 
Harris actually turned the switch on sort of late in the third set and still ended up losing that set. But that's when the match got interesting. That's when the match started having some excellent points. Right now, Kyrgios so frustrated with not having broken back. I'm going to hit it even harder, yes. move, but luckily for him, they happen to be going in. Renaissance in his career. Harris is doing a little, he steps forward now for the second serve return. But just a little bit slide to the left also, right, as the toss goes up, and it gives him a little bit more room. He's getting forehands on those second serve returns instead of left hip body backhands. Hatchinov's backhand is excellent. He's got the backhand down the line that he's roped beautifully a number of times, but that point was set up with a beautiful angle backhand. Followed it up to the net. It's quietly been up there 27 times. Let's persist. would be an impressive fifth set for Hatchinoff if he is able to break serve in the first game, never have him be in the semifinal, and hold all the way through. He's been in. He's been under duress in both of his service games. And even in this one, he's had to play some pretty excellent points to get to this 40-15 lead. So good. That forehand on the rise was amazing. Okay. Oh. What were you saying about that backhand? Backhand is a thing of beauty. I, I don't know if I'd be giving him that look. Maybe a little I'm more middle. By four games to two. Oh, you're feeling that rally. Or lower. Kyrgios was doing some good work when he kept it low. Kyrgios again has no room to slip here. No, and he feels in a hurry. He feels yes. when he doesn't get the break, when he's worked as hard as he has and it doesn't go his way. It, Sometimes takes him a couple of points to get over it. Might not have that luxury. Uh, 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 
once again. That play really has the second serve. Serving volley, volley just no, has not a, worked for him. It, it has not. Fifteen touches. how much pressure Hatchinoff's been feeling getting through this game. He, he, he'll feel a whole lot Thank less you. if Kyrgios gets broken now again. Thank you. Thank you. Players are ready. Good crowd here pushing it towards 1 a.m. Let's put yes. it. Second night in a row. Been entertained by a late night fifth set. Oh. Kira's making it easy with that move. He's been doing a better job on second serve this set by sort of not going in quite as far and sliding to his left to get a forehand. That time he fell into the trap that has happened to most of the match. Not backhand has been good. I mean, that backhand down line was a great stab from Kyrgios, a little bit of luck, and then Hatchinov stayed nice and calm. That was a ball you could panic on a little. He did not.
That's the slide around where he gets the forehand when Hashnaf tries to hit the body serve. That one was beautifully done, and he hit a forehand. It was sort of a angry first point of this game that he just gave away. backhand a backhand rally with Kyrgios because he's the guy that can change direction at a moment's notice but it is, it's been Hatchinoff that's done that better he's at 14 backhand winners Thank you. Dirty love. Actually a pretty smart serve because he took something off finally. He's been missing for serves. Took a little off that time just to make sure he doesn't face that second serve issue. Oh. 
some of the most work we've ever seen from Kyrgios if playing you know. point after point where he's being run and pushed. Thank you. Another 20 shot. Ready right for play. Here. All you can say is wow. Yeah. And you hear the effort that both are putting in. Oh, yeah. And all of that now is hatching off. Thank you. Moment. Game, set match, Hatano. Three sets to two. Reach. Seven First five, four six. Major seven semifinal. Five, six seven, six four. 